Hello guys, what is going on? TechRumiK here. So for today's video, I'm gonna show and present you this controller from EasySMX. This is the X10 Mechanic Master controller with hot swappable face plates, uh, whole effect uh, joysticks and triggers. Obviously that will eliminate stick drift and it makes the controller much more reliable. It's got uh, two D-pads on the back so you can map that to any in-game action. It works with PC, Nintendo Switch, Steam Deck, iOS and Android. It's got a battery about 1000 milliamps, so it's got a built-in battery which will last quite a few um, hours. And you can customize it with the EasySMX app. Obviously map the buttons, but you can do that from the controller as well. I like the box, it's got a nice design, gives you plenty of information. Let's go ahead and uh, open this up and I'm gonna show you guys what you get inside. After that, we're gonna hook it up to my PC and um, show you guys how it performs. Let's go ahead and do that right now. All right, so after opening the box, this is what you get. You get an instruction manual with the button layout in different languages, it tells you uh, what these buttons do because you have so many on it and you even got two on the side right here one it's um, one is to set the vibration the other one I think it's for mapping buttons I'm not sure you get um, USB type A to USB type C braided cable you can use this to charge the controller or you can use it in wire mode it's um, also quite long so you got a decent length to it I think it's about two meters you get a um, USB type A dongle which plugs into your PC or your laptop so you can um, use the controller with your PC with your laptop you never have to worry about Bluetooth or anything like that it's got 2.4 gigahertz I think on the back of the controller we have the M1 and M2 buttons which can be mapped to any in-game action you have a switch for uh, wireless wired Bluetooth and uh, Nintendo Switch. So it's got this um, Nintendo Switch uh, option specifically made for uh, the Switch. The buttons uh, feel quite good, they're clicky, they're nice. The joysticks and the triggers have whole effect sensors, so um, you never have to worry about stick drift, you never have to worry about anything like that. It's more precise, obviously, it will last longer as well have a front USB Type-C charging port obviously to charge it or use it in wire mode you have two extra buttons right here one I think it's to select the mode and the other one is to select the intensity of the vibrations and you also get some hot swappable plates for your controller they all magnetic so you can just swap them let me see if I can do it with one hand so you can take this off and replace it with a white one, have a white one here, a black one here. It all depends to you. You can also change this whole face plate, which I think it's really cool because sometimes it gets dirty. You need to clean it, take it out, clean it, put it back. Really simple to do. Uh, I'm going to go ahead now and plug this into my PC and um, show you guys how it works. It's uh, quite simple. I hope it will be just plug and play with no other issues. So let's go ahead and do that right now. Okay guys, so I've been testing the controller for about one hour now. I've been playing Doom Eternal. It's really, really simple to set up. It's literally plug and, plug and play. All you have to do is plug the dongle adapter to your um, PC or your laptop. After you've done that, press the middle button, home button. This light will turn on and it will take about one second for it to be paired. It will also vibrate. Um, I love how the whole effect sensors feel, the joystick and the triggers. It feels really snappy. There's absolutely no stick drift at all. And I also like the fact that it's very comfortable to keep in hand because of these textured uh, grips. That they are also interchangeable so you can change them with the white ones. Apart from that, uh, it's a solid experience, no issues, no lagging, no uh, delay, 
uh, it feels really really good the battery been lasting so long and uh, I didn't even charge it I just took it out of the box if you guys want to buy this controller I will have the link into the description below I will definitely recommend the controller pretty good experience for the price point and uh, yeah thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one